Okay guys, I wanna teach you about solo ads. And solo ads are basically where you're renting someone else's list. So what they do is they will send out your link, your uh, uh, offer, and kind of recommend that their subscribers on their list click your link, okay? Now, it's not a perfect marketing method and there are some things to watch out for, but basically what I'm gonna do is gonna give you a primer on solo ads. So if you're on Facebook, um, you know, you can search for solo ads and you'll see a bunch of uh, different, you know, groups and uh, that sort of thing. So, and there are people obviously offering uh, solo ads, right? So, I would take some time and go through some of these people and, uh, you know, join some of these groups and you'll see things um, like this, okay? So, hey, I have 100 to 500 uh, top tier clicks, ask about my special offer. Uh, plenty of solo, solo ads, 80% tier one. So tier one means like US and Canada, um, English speaking countries, um, that sort of thing. And then the other thing that you wanna look out for is, you know, a lot of people don't promote uh, some of these, um, you know, Empower Network or Mobi type, uh, type, type offers. So what I would do is I would PM them and, you know, ask them, hey, um, you know, how is your list built? You know, just just because I, I I think that's important to, um, you know, kind kind of understand, um, and it's it's always good to ask questions just to see what their what their answer is. You know, um, and if someone says, oh, it's none of your business or something, I'm going to find someone else. Also, the thing is, you want to look at so this guy ordered 100 clicks, got 116 clicks. Typically, you'll get a bit more than you order. 40% um, opt-ins. Okay, that's what I look for. If something is over 70% opt-ins, makes me very skeptical and would rather go with a smaller vendor, right? So you can scroll down, um, you know, one to 800 clicks, 90% top tier. Um, so you can go over and look at some of these people's sites, okay? So we're gonna go to this guy's site just as an example. Um, and you'll see that he'll log in and show his uh, Aweber account. So that's good, um, great reviews. So 45% opt-in, 40% opt-in. I think that's good. Um, so internet, make money, uh, 87,000 subscribers. Uh, do you send your buyers list? That's a good question to ask, right? Can I write the solo ad copy? Um, now this is actually good. If they let you write your own copy, that's more likely this is a real legitimate um, you know, solo ad rather than you're gonna get you know, bot traffic or, or, or something like this. So this would pass my uh, test, and you know what what you do is go through and order and uh, buy however many you want. Okay. Now um, the important thing is if you're using you know one of my systems here, um, let's say SimplePassiveIncome.com, what you're going to see is uh, I want you to go to the tracking tab. Okay. So on this on this uh, in this dashboard, don't just get one of your pages here under the capture pages. Go to the tracking tab, set up a new tracking uh, page, and that was just a test. So I'm gonna I'm gonna delete that. So let's say I bought an ad from um, uh, this guy, so Gary. So I'll set up um, you know I'll buy the ad, and this is a great way to get traffic you know right away to to uh, to your offer. So G Baker, I'll set up the name of it and then I'll pick which page I want it to go to. And you want it to go to one of the capture pages. So I'll click assign to tracking, okay? And the campaign is G Baker and I will just save, uh, save those changes, okay? Now when you're in here, um, you can actually view the stats and you can see um, how many opt-ins you got, you know, what the ratio was, how many unique clicks, um, and you can do that based on, um, you know, a month, a week, or a day, or, or uh, you know, see any of these, any of these other um, metrics, okay? So we'll go back to the uh, tracking tab, and this is the link that you actually use, okay? So you go here, and give him that link. And you see that it has uh, your username here and then it also has the tracking 
um, in there. Now what their solo vendors is, is going to do is they're not going to actually show this link. They're going to track it on their end um, and use something like uh, like pretty links so they can show you that they've delivered the amount of clicks. So even if this is a long, ugly URL, uh, don't worry about it because they're going to track it too. So you're going to give them, uh, you're going to buy the solo ad and then you're going to um, uh, send it out to them and uh, you can supply the copy if you want and then you will uh, you'll send that out right so this is the top one united states uh, united kingdom canada australia new zealand and ireland okay so that's pretty much it um you know this this looks like a good guy to uh to test out i uh, certainly think it's it's legit and that's a great way to get get started in solo ads so i hope this video was helpful and we'll see you in the next one.